Welcome to my world. This is Heaven and Earth, playing Minecraft on the PS4. How are we doing? I hope everyone else is uh, pretty good. If you're a new follower, welcome. If you're an existing follower, welcome again. Um, not been on Minecraft that much over the last few weeks. Um, <coughs> pardon me. Got a... Uh, got the uh, Metal Gear Solid 5 so I've been hammering that well playing that I only have a few hours of an evening and some weekends now and again and um, so I have been playing that and it's really really good I was thinking of doing maybe a program on that a video on that but uh, I haven't done I just thought uh, I'd play it and see how it goes Um other than that I've been what else I've been doing I've been playing a little bit of Ark I got Ark um, on PC, uh, recommended uh, by Radio Man. So he's, I think he's going to be doing a series on Arc, and that looks pretty cool. Uh, my computer's only got a 660 uh, GeForce NVIDIA card in it, so I can only play on medium. I know there's a couple of tweaks you can do, but uh, yeah, so it's all right. You know, it's one of them. It's all right. Another than that, been playing Kerbal Space Program on PC. Um, that's been filling up some of my time, and it's it's just an awesome game. It's just there's no other word for it. It's awesome. If you've not seen it, it's on Steam. It's worth every penny. Believe me. Right back to this. Right, what I've been up to. Um, last weekend I did have a good blast on it, and last week uh, had some time during the week, so I've done, only been doing little bits. I've not done enough to do a video, so I thought I'll just plod on and see where I get to so today I think I've done enough to to warrant doing a video um, and I hope that you like what you see now this eventually at last what is it it's a bridge woohoo <laughs> yeah right show you how I've done it um, looks quite a it's just something we did um, my wife just uh, give me some input what looks good just some upside down stairs arches two stairs coming out and three across and two down and all the way across and obviously on the cross section just a column going straight down so let's just go in the water so that's the base of it you can see how it kind of looks if you if you need to pause it pause it have a look and then now these are one two three four five six seven eight nine tenth so there's nine blocks distance between the fire up there. I'll show you how that works. So also with me just doing a bridge, I just I did the bridge first of all, and we we did uh, did the lighting and everything. I thought, well, I'm going to get down to stone resource. <laughs> you know, I see it down there. It's I've just dug all sorts out. In fact, while we're here, I'll just show you how much I've dug out. I started digging some of this out last time. Last time I needed some stone. The, I mean, all this was just solid solid stone so i've dug all this out when because I, I was needing some stone yep there's a zombie spawner there and that's another spawner there another zombie spawner so i've dug all this extra bit out here all this was full and obviously this is all the stone to building the castle and everything and then Here's the end. Now, as you can see here, I've been digging more out. And I've dug all this out again because I've been needing stone. It's madness. Absolute madness. And then it goes all the way down to the bottom there. So it's quite a fair trek <laughs> to go get some stone. So all I've been doing is just cutting in these little bits here. I think here is a part of a slime spawner. It's like something keeps spawning there. Anyway, we digress. So I will go back up on top of the bridge and we'll see how it all works. So yeah, just uh, going back. Yeah, Metal Gear Solid. I can't really say anything about the first 20 minutes of the game because it's just mind-blowing it it's just mind-blowing right i'll continue with that in a minute right this bit here because it's a bridge i needed a way down so we'll first of all we'll go up so you can see how i've done it 
Ta-da! So all I've done is just the stairs just facing the other way so it gives it a bit of an edge, a bit of a rim. And then upside down stairs. One, two, three. I'll do it so it's like one, two, corner one, three, all upside down with um, some nether rack in there and just some iron fences. And so I've done that all the way across. So there's nine spaces. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. On the tenth one, another line. So and this works. I've been down, up and down here in the horse because it all has to be horse friendly because that's the main reason why we have the bridge. I'll get to what's going on over there in a minute. So from there, it just works really, really well. And then down a little bit, across, down. So because over here at some point, and I'll keep saying it, but I'll say it again, I want to do like a, like a, a like a, like a, what was that? I'm just trying to think now. Like a, like a stadia, small stadia, like a killing arena. Because I think that would look absolutely awesome. And I'm going to have it so then the zombie spawner can call the zombies up on demand. So that will be fun to work out. That will be good. So this is the bridge. Love it now. Okay. How, how mighty, I keep on thinking how mighty it is. So how have I done this? So all I did was... Built some stairs down. That's all I did. And then a, a full block on the end with the railing on. With the iron, iron rail. And that's it. So it looks quite effective. I think it looks pretty cool. Pretty cool. So that was the first bit. Uh, what I wanted to show you. There's three main bits I wanted to show you. Uh, additions. This was uh, the first one. So I think uh, I think this grand because it has to be a grand bridge for a grand castle. I think this uh, this is a welcome addition to the world. So now I should I could have got my horse, but we're nearly there anyway. So so yeah. So Metal Gear Solid back to Metal Gear Solid until I get there. Right. Yeah. First twenty minutes, <sighs> mind blowing. Absolutely mind-blowing i was just took aback by it so we're here now already but other than that it is i read somewhere it's the most it's the the best um like covert covert game available like snow like sneaky game there is and i've got to say it's worth its weight in gold it's really is a good game all right this last time we was on oh it's okay it's not getting dark again is it Ah! Have I got any torches? Right. What I'll do, because I don't want to go down there and spoil it yet, I'll just, I'll pause it here and I will sleep and come back. Okay, see you shortly. Morning! It's back again, right. Where was we? Right, this, this first edition here is my lumber mill. And what it, last time we was here, um, I did, there's like a plateau there of, well, I'll show you what it is. It's like a little plateau with a little bit of a lake in there, only a little lake. And it goes all the way down here. Now this is the the wheel with some cauldrons in. Oh, let's get it. Some cauldrons. Oops, let's go all the way around here. So the cauldrons theoretically water flows this way, picks up the water, turns the wheel, which is just upside down stairs of the uh, wooden planks. Upside down, it's normal stairs, normal stairs, and then some fencing, block, full block, full block, and a bolt. Keep it on. So that's what, what that is. Now that in turn, once if there was animation to it, that would turn, it would flow that way, so then the wheel would go around this way. That in turn would power the cutter. So let's go over there. The blade. 
the, the lumber mills blade which is just this so dug 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 and then so you'd feed the wood into here all from all the trees which we've used a lot of <laughs> and it cut it all up and here's just a little bit of storage of some pre-cut pieces you know I've not kind of worked out the rest of it yet because I need to do something here because I'll get to that bit in a minute so that's how it how it works so all I've done same same design roof as the building over there except it's inverted so it's dark oak on the outside where that's light oak on the outside there so no that's not a dark oak idiot no that's spruce because we don't know i don't have dark oak that's spruce that's oak and then all this is just oak wood which that's where half the trees came from <laughs> so here another design which is just a block up and then a stir out just to trim all the way around so it looks like it's uh, like suspended um just had to build some of this mud up so the sorry dirt up so then that way you know it just kind of looks like it's it's purposeful and this is just um some bits which get help it help the uh, the trees on its merry way so i hope that you like that that's the that's the uh the lumber mill yeah right so when i paused it before i had to run all the way down here because my bed's down here so let's just go down here now this bit here so last time we was here i think we'll come up to let's say just up to about here and then there was just like a wall of dirt just literally here just a wall of dirt so as you can see i've you know just extended it slightly a little bit so i'm um, gonna put some buildings next time on here don't know what kind but I will do now this is a, a spawner down there because i found it through one of the caves so i've just kept that there in fact let's just get rid of some of this it looks awful doesn't it right cool so this is like a shipyard whoa what's fallen sheep <sighs> right <laughs> How can I show this? Right, so what these are, these are cranes basically. What, it's like going crazy with the controller. Right, these are cranes and how they work is some supporting bits there and I can't see from here. Tell you what, let's go over here. Uh, just elevate myself. There we go. So yeah, these two are cranes here. One that back one's lower, because I'd assume there'd be a lower one, and then the front one's here. It's on the back, and what it's doing is, obviously these are wooden, like sleepers, where they were. It'll just roll the ship down. So at the moment, that crane that crane and the back one about just lowering the deck down so that's gonna that's like a ship shipyard isn't it so that's quite cool so i do need to build some houses i need to do some supply shops and all that kind of stuff well something like that and a farm as well still need the farm so i can do the hay but sorry the wheat so you know there is a lot to do now what all this is let me come down I'll explain. Because silly me, silly me. I built, before I, what did I, I did the mill first and then I did the shipyard. And I just did the water running down here into like a, you know, something nice, like a little waterfall. Like a feature. But then I started building this. I was going to build this here. But I thought, well, no, because I want it a part of the dock. And I didn't really want to stretch the dock all the way around. There's no point. I didn't I didn't want to because it just wouldn't have looked right. Cause it, I need to build it up on the, at, on, the, on the land side rather than just on the coastal side. So I built this here and it was a mistake. Because really, I've already dug out where I'm thinking it's going. 
because the wheel's there and it's already like kind of on an angle anyway I just thought if I continue it down move it so then that way it is more of a feature and then like build a bridge over over the um, like the the waterfall and then maybe build another slight like a wooden bridge just just a bridge at this stage no path or anything like that just just a bridge over it maybe fill that in as well um, or take some out even I could do it taking some out because I, I like I want to I do want to take it out but I haven't done it yet um, like a wooden small wooden bridge from here to here big enough so then that way anything can go through um, cause ships won't wouldn't necessarily go through this it's, it's a bit narrow but uh, the normal boats will so yeah so that is all I've been up to so there's a uh, quite a bit of landscaping just to do <laughs> for this um, so I'll show you with this so the other reason why I wanted this here so you can see see more of it here the more of a reason why I wanted it over here is because with this making the wood it, ignore this because I need to sort it out sort out the land sort out some steps sort out some proper access and some like paths um you know like a bit of gravel down or not quite sure how that's going to work yet but once i've sorted that out it's going to look all right because i wanted it so then that way as soon as wood has come out of a, a mill i wanted it to you know they've got easy access then for the boats where if it was if this on the other side how are they going to get it across? Carry it, you might say. But, no, let's just keep it here. Let's keep it in a similar location. And then that way it, it looks cool. I mean, I've not had this built long enough to see what spawns. I mean, there will be something what spawns here at night. But I sleep as soon as it goes night time. Because I don't want to don't want a creeper to blow it all up. But, um... I've run out of glowstone, so I need to get some of that. Um, so I could f do with filling the corner parts in, you know, like I've done across there and there and there. Just fill that in all the way around. Oof. Yeah, that'll look cool. Let's have a look from this way. Yeah. Just looks like a load of wood, doesn't it? <laughs> but yeah, it's, so this is what I've been up to. And I thought, you know, this kind of warrants me doing a, another video. So hope you like it. If there's anything you want to see, what I've done, and you want a closer, closer look, by all means, leave a comment down below. And uh, next time I'll just focus on that a little bit more for you. Um... What else have I been playing? Um, yeah, but I had a go on our arc. Now, I played. I put, start again. I played it for about four, or five. No, more than that. Five, six hours, maybe. Um, you dude, and you just roam about. There's dinosaurs everywhere. So if you like dinosaurs, you'll probably like it. But you need a monster of a computer to play the thing on decent graphics. Um, medium. It's all right. You know, it can probably pull about 30 frames a second out of it. But it's not... You want it all nice, don't you? I mean, so for me, Ark, I think I'm going to wait till June. It's out next June on console, on uh, Xbox, and I think it's on PS4, but definitely on Xbox. So, so that's one to probably get then, because obviously there's a server side as well, playing with friends and all that, and it does work out quite expensive. Um, like private servers and things like that. So yeah, so I played it for about six hours and messed about, managed to... It's a bit like Minecraft, you know, you get your clothes on and things like that. You make clothes as a campfire so you don't freeze. If you go in the water, you get cold. And if you're running on the beach, you get hot and you need to get dehydrated. So you got to drink water. And then you start to think, oh, I'm going to go across a little bit. You know, there's like a little bit of water like there is here. I'll tell you what, what I'll do. I'll just um, I'll just jump in 
and I'll swim over there. So you do that, you've got all your gear on you, and then all of a sudden, there's these dinosaur piranhas, yeah? And they eat you. And you're like a le level 6, level 7, so you've not, you know, you've played it for a few hours, but level 21 piranhas, and it's not just a piranha, right? It's a school of piranhas. So when you die, it's like... You know on this when you die all your bits are everywhere, you're like all your items are just all over the show like in a small vicinity. No on this game, it's like a like a like a knapsack, like a just on the floor. So I find where I've spawned you start you spawn at the same place most times and you go back to where you died and you try and get your bag. You can't get your bag because the piranhas eat you again. So I've not played it since I bought it, basically done me in just did me in you might say yeah it's a bit defeatist when I, i've already lost my stuff twice before this point and i thought no i'll make it all again because i was lost i couldn't find where i was but no, I, it just did me in uh so i've not played that <laughs> since <laughs> so yeah um let's get over here there we go so the duck's coming along all right now. We've got, we've got a wood resource. Well, plank resource, if we put some planks in there. and Just need to get some houses, some farms and things. And maybe a tower on the end right over there. So that's where I'm up to. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you'd like to leave a comment, leave a comment. Leave a like if you'd like to leave a like. Other than that, thank you very much for watching. And I'll speak to you again next time.